the Chelsea winger was instrumental in helping the Red Devils secure a third-placed finish at last summer's World Cup in Russia. But things could have been very different for the 28-year-old if he had not learnt the values and responsibilities of being a professional at the top level. Back in 2011, Hazard was still relatively unknown on the world stage. Admittedly, he was beginning to make huge steps at Lille which had already captured the attention of his national team Belgium. He was playing for his country in a Euro 2012 qualifier against Turkey back in June 2011, when one of the lowest points in his career took place. With half an hour still to play, manager Georges Leakins decided to sub Eden Hazard who was furious and refused to acknowledge the coach as he departed the field. He stormed down the tunnel and even left the stadium while the match continued. Hazard was then later pictured eating a burger at a fast food restaurant in Brussels with the rest of his family. The images were splashed across nearly every newspaper in Belgium causing Leekens to punish the star with a two-game suspension. Now the Chelsea winger can see the funny side of the story now that he has become one of Belgium's most prized assets. When asked on what sauce was in the famous hamburger, he told RTBF, It was a delusion, it has always been my favourite sauce. I have some pots in London, I ask Mon to bring me back every time she comes. That night, I did a stupid thing, but the story of the hamburger, we talk about it in a joke, it's in quotation marks, what makes my legend with the selection of Belgium. Close quote Hazard is now approaching the final year of his Chelsea contract, and the Blues now face a dilemma surrounding his future as they do not want to risk losing him on a free transfer. Zinedine Zidane is reportedly keen on bringing Hazard to the Bernadou as part of his new project, to turn Real Madrid's fortunes around. With Maurizio Sarri's side currently in sixth place in the Premier League, their best chance of Champions League qualification for next season is now by winning the Europa League.